Welcome to another Your Tech Report video. Today we continue our hands-on with the LaC 6 Big 36 terabyte enclosure. In our first video of the LaC 6 Big, we unboxed the drive array. We showed you about the actual drive itself, the two Thunderbolt 3 ports on the back, the USB 3.1 port in the back, etc., etc. I've gone ahead now and reconfigured my desk and actually placed it placed it over here so you can see the actual drive in its spot. Now, here's something that I didn't realize. When you actually get the drive and unbox it, everything is actually set up with RAID 5 ready to go. So you have everything ready to go. You can plug it in and start using it. What I didn't realize was that it was ready to go. So I did a couple things that I would normally do to a new hard drive system. I wiped it and then I went to rebuild the array. When you rebuild the array on a drive system that has 36 terabytes, you have to do something that's called initializing those drives thereafter. Initializing obviously checks for errors and makes sure that everything is set so that you can start using the drive array without any issues. What I didn't know is that 36 terabytes would take probably a couple days, um, if not longer, to actually initialize. So it's been several days since it's been set up on my desk here that it's been initializing. Um, the other thing I didn't realize when I was reading up on why it takes so long to initialize is that I could actually speed up that process by enhancing the priority of CPU to initialization. This means that I can make the CPU use more of its time and power towards initializing the device, which will speed up the process. So let's take a look. I'm gonna bring you a little bit closer to my computer so you can see the LaCie RAID software and how it's set up and how you can actually configure and manipulate it. As you can see here, we got the LaCie RAID manager going up on the computer. This shows you the actual RAID array. You can see that I've initialized here at 58%. This has been going on for about two days now. I actually only changed the CPU prioritization, as you can see here, from low to high uh, this morning. So it's actually jumped a fair bit this morning from 50 to 58. So you can see that it's going to speed up in that aspect. It should be done by tomorrow, which is kind of cool. Within the LaCie RAID manager, you can do things like, obviously, control performance details right here. You can actually change app settings, which is the app in which we're using. You can set notifications. Here you've I've got a full range of notifications. You can see when initialization rate changed. You can see when the fans changed. You can see everything that happened here. Um, updates allow you to update the firmware on the device itself. So if you need a firmware update to the LaCie RAID enclosure, the six big enclosure, that will happen right here. And you can see the overview of the array. You can see all the drives, all six drives, what their status is right now. It's background initialization at 58%. You can see the array details. It's going to be configured as a 30 terabyte array with a 512 kilobyte disk block. Stripe size is 1024K. Um, we're enabling it for performance. It's going to be RAID level 5. So you can configure everything with this here as well, including maintenance tasks. You can actually schedule maintenance to happen on this device. One of the things you can't do at the same time, while you're initializing, you can't have other maintenance going on. So when the initialization is done, we'll be able to go through this and see everything else that we can do. So that's where we stand right now with the LaCie 6 Big 36 terabyte edition. We're going to wait for the initialization to obviously complete fully, and then we'll give you even more hands-on We'll talk about performance. We'll talk about disk utilization. We'll see how fast this really does work, especially on the Thunderbolt 3 interface, which is really cool. Now, we got some slack in the comments on some other videos saying, hey, you notice how they always promise to follow up and never actually do it? Well, that's, we got a lot of products we're going through, and we apologize for that. And this is proof positive that we're doing follow-ups, as you can see right here. And we're going to have even more follow-ups to this LaCie 6 Big once everything is initialized. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and don't forget to hit that little notification button so that you're notified instantaneously, instantly, immediately when we have a new video ready for you guys.